Okay. Before I start this review, I wanted to say I'm not trying to be a professional product reviewer or whatsoever. All my videos are like straight raw, a little bit edited, of course. Hey, Harley, get off the product review table. Down. But yeah, I just wanted to say that because somebody in the comments said, uh, suggested I should have, you know, um, a, like a, uh, like a backdrop, a nice backdrop, and, uh, lights and, uh, what, what are those, softbox lighting and, and, you know, for a professional review, but when I'm doing these videos, I'm not trying to be a, like, professional product reviewer, it's just, um, me buying stuff that I want and like or think that I'll like you know from the looks of it I'll buy it and then I'll put a raw real somewhat uncut unscripted video together of that product see like uh, I'm not trying to be a professional you know uh, or try to get monetized or have perfect grammar or perfect English like what the fuck is that that's not what I'm trying to do here I'm just you know grabbing what, what the fuck are these uh, footrests footstools and the product that I'm I purchased myself uh, and talk about it you know not in no professional way just a one-on-one -on -one with whoever's watching this that's my aim uh, so yeah I wanted to clear that up um, so today this review is gonna be traditional arms posters right here um, I put two of these footstools together footrests whatever the fuck it's called um, because I'm going to have other products to compare this to. But uh, wait, let me grab... I forgot the paper. Uh, it's not full spy. Let me go grab it real quick. Um, when they shipped this out, they just put it in... I threw the uh, USPS bag away that it came in, right? They just wrapped it up in some, uh, some uh, paper wraps, right? Nothing fancy, you know. Um, but it, they did include this uh, card right here it is right here uh, traditional arms custom kydex gear www.traditionalarms.com um, that's their logo here's a sticker you know nice skull hey did y'all see Harley come back put the card back here Put the card back here down. She snatched it away thinking she's slave. Did y'all see that? You silly. I'm trying to do a product review of traditional arms holster. Okay, yep. She took the business card and tore it up. Y'all see this? Harley. She tore the business card up. <laughs> Here's all the little... Oh my goodness, here's the other pieces of it. Why'd you do this, huh? Why'd you do this, Harley? You did this? You did this? You did this? No. It's okay, look at you. So pretty. Okay, this one that I got is the uh, jab. J-A-B inside the waistband holster um, I got the one with the dual clips and uh, the pattern is Goyard red uh, that's the only ones they make at the moment the color red uh, but Goyard has green like a dark green yellow black blue um, do they have green? I don't remember, but I think that's 
all the colors they really actually have the Goyard brand but I mean uh, this is not this is not um, like real uh, Goyer texture from the uh, wallets or bags or whatever. This is just a print, right? Um, like a copy, but they did it really, really good. Really well printed and designed. It's, it's not like scratching off or um, looks like they did a horrible job. They built this very well. I'm impressed and uh, that's what got my attention because uh, I like Goyer, the brand, and then to actually have it uh, on a holster. I'm not going to uh, conceal carry this. I'm actually going to put it inside my bag, um, which is right here. I'll put it inside this part for the easy access to a pistol but I always keep my firearms in a holster um, every firearm in a holster or a box that's a lock box but uh, this is what's gonna be going in it yes it's purple um, it's Glock 19 ported barrel uh, what else hollow sun this is the HS507KX2 uh, red dot. This is the slim line because I like the smaller ones. It doesn't hang off on the side. Um, as you can see right here, it's not flush, but it's like it doesn't hang off the sides like uh, regular RMRs and uh, what is that? HS507C? 509s or something like that? I, I forgot what what else um you know so many models but uh this one has the adapter plate um to fit the 507k x2 onto a uh glock 19 um but uh yeah so the fit is snug i mean they put a glock 19 and then tighten up the screws uh, before they shipped it to me, I mean, I could tell because the screws are tight, the tension. And uh, it, it just looks good. Uh, the little cutout slot for the red dot you could order with or without, I think. I'm not sure, I forgot. Um, but this is how I ordered it, and this is how it came. Uh, I think it was only like $88, $80 plus $8 shipping and handling, which is uh, really good. And the durability is really good. I mean, here's my uh, carbon fiber one, and this one's kind of thin. I could feel it that it's thinner than this one, which this one feels like... Uh, like a tank so this one didn't come out with a cutout um, I had to Dremel this you know modders modder fuckers but uh yeah this is a quick look it's not actually a in-depth review uh, oh my sweat guard is I got the uh, mid mid uh length but uh yeah quick look not a in-depth review of this but check out Traditional Arms Holster, traditionalarms.com.